I now think back when I was a kid and rode in those areas um, with my mum and dad and in the car and on my own and my bike, um, you know, everything looked huge. Um, it looked high, it looked wide, it looked far. And I thought that it may change because I'm a little bit bigger now and a little bit older, but it hasn't. It is still as majestic as ever before. I've cycled all over the country. I can't think of an area where I enjoyed cycling more than here. I think people that have never witnessed or experienced the, the, the beauty of Namakuland in springtime saw exactly what the brochures talk about and what they read in, in the newspapers and what they see on the internet. Um, you, you, you see flowers upon flowers upon fields of flowers. It's just amazing. Um, on a bicycle, you, you become one with nature. Yeah, I just need some stitches, I think. I think that many people came here because of the flowers and they were not disappointed. It was really, really so colourful. It's like from a picture book. The initial objectives of proclaiming Guhab was that it becomes a flower garden, you know, to conserve the flowers that are in the Namokwaland area so that people can come and see them. The size currently is 15,000 acres, and the name Kuhab comes from the Nama uh, name, meaning uh, water hole. We have got around 581 plant species that have been recorded in Kuhab. We have got 30 uh, reptiles, we have got three amphibians that have been recorded here, and, and, and many more, you know, the Hemsborg, the ostrich, that are here in the reserve. That makes it so unique. There must be climbs for the climbers, there must be downhills for the guys that like their playing, there must be a little bit of technical, there must be flat roads. That makes a mountain bike race. Otherwise, you know, that is, that's nature, and that's why we ride our bikes, that's why we enjoy it. And to ride in this terrain and this toughness of, of, of the Macqualand, I think is, is an absolute um, honour and it's a privilege. And to see the flowers whilst riding is fantastic. The venues, I think, was amazing. And that makes, it, it, it actually um, contributes a lot to a race. Because to, to arrive at a place in these facilities where you can, you know, you have your coffee, and I love my coffee, to have hot, good coffee. You know, to be able to go to a beautiful, clean facility, you know, to have a fantastic shower afterwards. You know, the food was out of this world. I mean, we got school pikers. For people that don't know what that is, it's, you know, it's a, it's a very special South African meal that I grew up on with the bush. So it, for me, it brings back a lot of, um, almost, I want to say, memories, although I don't, I didn't grow up in this area. It makes you feel at home. So yeah, it was, for me, it was very, very special. I'll definitely be back. If, I, if I'm still pedaling my bike, I'll be back.